<laughs> this is getting, this is getting, this video is getting realer as we go here. <laughs> God, this thing, man. Must not chip the floor there, lady. Oh, no, I didn't mean Let's do 32 to. inches. Really stressed out. That seem good? Mm -hmm. And you want it right there. Today, Emily's been on me to do this for a long time. Fister sent us uh, towel hooks, toilet paper holders, towel holders, all kinds of uh, stuff for bathrooms. So we're gonna be mounting those today. This right here is a towel hook. We're gonna put two of these here in the girls' bathroom. I just got done mounting the toilet paper holder, which we'll take you to right now. And then we'll come back and show you how to mount these. They all mount in the same way, which is nice and consistent. Oh, Let's do 32 inches. Ow. Does that seem good? Mm -hmm. And you want it right there. Right there? Sure. All right. Let's see how close this is to a stud. See, there's a stud right here. Or you just, you don't really care. No, that's probably fine. Like, so this side, what you'd want to put into a stud? Well, I mean, it would be beneficial if we could get it into a stud. Sure. I mean, that's pretty natural right there. Mm -hmm. All right. All right, so we are mounting a Fister toilet paper holder. Consists of that guy, this guy, and these two brackets. I place this bracket into a stud because it was conveniently located here. This one I put drywall anchors in. And then this part of the Thing pivots so you can put a new roll on. So, got the brackets mounted. Now we're gonna attempt to put these on. It's just got a little set screw in there. So you hook the top over the edge of the bracket and then you tighten that set screw. It's a little tedious because it's close to the wall. Still level. This part of the toilet paper should always be out from the wall. Should never be like this. I'll never tell you you're doing anything wrong unless you put your toilet paper on like that. So whether it is a 
towel holder, paper, um, toilet paper holder, or like a towel hook, they all mount in the same fashion. So they have a mounting bracket. In this case, we just have one. Come with a couple drywall anchors, a couple screws, and an Allen wrench. And so this gets mounted on the wall where you want it. If you can go into a stud, that's uh, the preferred way. And then this hooks over, latches onto the top of that bracket, and then a set screw on the bottom gets tightened to lock it on. So pretty simple process. Ooh, look at that toilet paper holder, it's so nice. So we're gonna mount these lower because the girls are not very big right now. And we want them to use the towel yes. hooks. So about right there. So that's about 46 inches. Okay. Okay. 46 inches. We have a stud above this outlet somewhere. Just loosen that. So that little set screw is up high enough. Take the top, hook it over, push it against the wall, and then tighten the set screw tediously. Oh, so these are mounted a little bit lower because, like I said, our girls need to be able to reach them. Toilet paper holder. Paper out. Are we paper out people or paper in people? That is the question. Sure, there's about 400 of these, more of these that I have to do. So let's get going.
Ronnie. So cute. Sixteen three quarters, so eight and three eighths. Appreciate everybody watching this. That's gonna be a wrap on the bathroom accessories. Um, I will say that uh, these are really nice in the fact that they all mount um, the same. Um, they are really high quality. It uh, seems like they're really well made. So I wanna thank Fister for partnering with us on this. If you guys are interested in any of this, you can check it out. Um, the links are in the description. But as always, thanks for watching. If you haven't hit that subscribe button, go ahead and hit it, and we will catch you on the next video.